Hi friends, let's learn today how to do the export and import of SQL Server Database Schema. Till now we have did the restoration of the SQL Server Database. So today I'm going to tell you uh, how to do the export and import of SQL Server Database Schema. So this is an interview question also. Uh, it's a tricky question. Uh, sometimes uh, interviewer asked, uh, you know, uh, some uh, uh, um, unlinked questions, uh, which is, you know, uh, not so frequently used so normally uh, we are doing the refresh of you know the uh, production to uh, development right uh, for the testing purpose so we are doing the refresh database complete uh, refresh from the production to development but uh, they ask for the you know uh, for the single schema to do the you know uh, refresh from the production to development so uh, i can tell you uh, this task is so frequently used in a Oracle database, uh, but here in a SQL, uh, we all used to complete database refresh, right? But in a Oracle, uh, normally uh, it's a day to day task. Uh, it do the refresh from production schema to development. Okay. And uh, so uh, sometimes you need to uh, be ready to, you know, to catch the unlinked questions also, right? So uh, in this session, I'm going to tell you how to do that. So welcome to my channel, Tech and Art, guys. Hope you are doing well. Uh, so I have created one playlist here as I told you uh, there are more than 60 70 videos 73 videos which is all related to uh, SQL Server database lives based scenarios which we are delivering the you know uh, project day to day okay and all are uh, based on the performance tunings and the live uh, live issues and all okay so you can go and watch it and if you like that video please do subscribe and share to others as well thank you guys so let's come to the point so i'm going to tell you the correct method and very quick method to how to do the export and import of sql server database schema for that you need to go to the management studio and you need to, you need to do the uh, you know at the left panel right click the database you would like to export the schema click on a database right click and choose the task and generate the script as we all aware we can generate the database script go to task and generate the script once you click the script okay then welcome wizard will be open select the database object to the screen you need to select the database objects here which schema you need to expand the tables and select the schema even the store procedure also you can do it uh, you can select that particular schema and then here you need to uh, give the attention uh, Click on advance and select the option types of data to a script and choose the schema only. So here only you need to go, uh, give the focus, go to advance and here types of data to select and here you need to select schema only. So it will select the schema only. It will not select the entire database and choose the path where you want to keep the script. Okay. And do the uh, save and then restore it on a development where it is asked. So for this, uh, I'm not going to do the live now because I can tell you I have already created here. If you come to playlist, I'm not sure who all watched or not. If you come click on a play all and if you scroll down here, uh, I have created already here the SQL database restored without any data. So this video is covering the live session about, you know, uh, all those, you know, uh, schema refresh and all. How to you do how to do the database restore without any data only you need to uh, you know take the schema and a function store procedure you can take it from this way so i have already created the video here you can go and watch it i'm not going to do again i just uh, showed you uh, where it is uh, it's like a uh, title is called database restored without any data you can watch it it's very helpful and very useful also so through this way you can do the quickly export and import uh the particular schema okay so uh what i'm trying to say uh sometimes we all used to uh, do the restore complete database only uh we didn't notice at all we can do the uh you know particular schema also right without uh and we can do the database uh, we can create a dummy database without any data right only the structure and all so uh it's all kind of uh, things is possible in a SQL also, uh, but we normally use the so uh, rarely this kind of uh, request. So that's the reason we didn't, uh, you know, uh, use to. So uh, thus 
try to uh, do the live testing uh, do some testing on a development first and give a comment whether it's working for uh, for you or not if you need any help go to this video and watch it how to do that i'm not going to create again so that's it guys for today how to do the export import schema for a spill database uh, in the next video i will meet you soon till then bye bye thank you thanks for watching and please like to subscribe my channel thank you